Hey, what's up guys? This is Justin at wingsound.com. In this Pro Tools tutorial, I'm going to show you how to AB your plugin settings. Don't forget, you can always get in contact with me with any questions, comments, or ideas, Justin at wingsound.com. All right, so I have a base here and I'm gonna instantiate the four band digi EQ. And as you can see, there's a compare button. It's not active yet because I haven't made any changes. So I'll make some very drastic changes here. And as you can see, the compare button turned blue, so now it's active. And if I hit it, it goes back to zero. So I can AB between a process base and an unprocessed base. At this point, it's almost like bypassing. So I'll play it right now. All right, you get the idea there. So another thing you could do is if you load up a preset that's here or one that you've created, I'll choose the bright base. All right, and then start making some changes. Again, drastic, so you could hear what's going on. Then you hit the compare and it goes back to that original bright base preset. So it's really cool. I'll play it right now. Now this is essential for mixing, so you could really AB between whatever changes that you make. You can also use this compare function within any plugins that you have in Pro Tools. It's really cool. Check out Wingsound on the iTunes store to subscribe to the podcast, listen to some music, and download the free iPhone app that will keep you up to date with all of the latest releases from Wingsound Studios. Just search for Wingsound at the iTunes store.